Welcome back to Let's Play Delayed Pokemon X The Guild of Darkness. Always a delay whenever I start recording. It's always like two second delay. I don't know, wherever. Uh, so it's been a while, not months like last time. I don't think even it, I don't think it's even been a month. It's been a, at least maybe two weeks since I last of this. I've been recording the Final Fantasy uh, ten mostly. Which is insane, like, yeah, that's right, where is it? It's, let me see here, how many, like, which part was that? It's like the 6th of March today, and on the 1st of March, I uploaded part 60 that I'll be, I'm up to part 80 now, so 20 parts recorded in advance of that one. But guess how many views that one video from, like, a couple, like, the, like, five days ago, essentially. Two views. Just like... That LP's got no attention whatsoever, view-wise. Part before that, though, got, uh, ten. But, you know, the upload channel and all that. Heck, when I <laughs> randomly uploaded uh, the final part of Fragile Dreams, an LP I did years ago, but I had to, uh, like, I noticed, like, it was muted, so I, like, put in a little bit of extra commentary and re-upload it. And even that's got more views than that. It's like currently, as I'm recording, it's clearly obvious that this LP right here has the most attention. Followed by probably Parasite Eve 2, which is a bit surprising. And then Sims, and then, ah, uh, Five Fantasy Death. And that's gonna be like. I honestly, that's obviously gonna be like the LP that will still be ongoing once. Like, I've already, like, I still to this day I haven't actually done the after LP doors for Sims Must and Out and Parasite Eve 2. But I have completed the recording for those LPs quite some time ago at this point. So I know those will eventually be, like, finished soon ish in the next couple of weeks. While this one is still ongoing, but. Clearly, Final Fantasy X is going to be the one that will still be ongoing after all this, but anyways. I was surprised I was only rambling for two and a half minutes there. I thought surely I was rambling into five minute territory at least. So we last left off, uh, if I recall, we snagged the Shadow Dragonite, so now we got all of them. Ah oh, yeah, that's the thing, isn't it? Yeah. Gotta go purify Tauros and, uh, uh, actually, I've also remembered, like, actually, what part was it? I think it was the previous part that I played. Yeah, part 49 uploaded on the 3rd was when I visited the Orc Coliseum for the first and only time so far, so I think I'm gonna check that out and try to get my revenge. I also think that it's probably like with all Pokemon games, like Pokemon Sun and Moon, for example, with that bloody battle tree. I think it has the same thing where it probably just like, if you're over leveled compared to the uh, levels of your opponent, you probably get your levels decreased to that level. So Espen would probably be level 60 for that. While everyone else wouldn't get a level increase because the game's like, fuck that shit. We only decrease levels, we don't increase them. We don't, we don't play fair in that way. We favor the CPU. Isn't that how it's always been? Remember Battle Frontier? Remember the Battle Towers in various Pokemon games? Remember the Battle Tree? That's kind of new, but sucks. Where are we going here? Oh, yeah. I still haven't played Pokemon Moon in quite a while. Like, to get those screenshots I did a while back, that was like the last time I played it. I didn't even play it properly. I just like looked through my Pokemon and I was just like, okay, which ones did I use again? Just like, there's really no reason to actually, like, it doesn't feel like there's any reason to play it after that. Like, it's like the Battle Trees just doesn't really appeal to me. If I was LPing it, I'd probably, you know, suddenly have a bit of motivation to actually try to do it. That's the thing I've noticed with LPing. Is it gives you a little bit of extra motivation to do like extra side stuff that you usually wouldn't be bothered to do outside of it, essentially. 
There's a Pac-Man nice radio up in the top. It's like the battle frontier in Emerald. I probably would have never that been able to actually complete it if I didn't actually help it and actually, you know, put in the effort to try. I mean, sure, I use save state for some bits, but hey, it's a freaking bullshit rule place, man. And I, it's not like I save state in between battles, it's just save state between, like, the start of, like, each tournament entry and shit, and stuff like that, because it sucked with the rules. It's like, oh, you save the game at the start, and if you lose and you rage quit, turn off the console or whatever, then you'll come back and be like, oh, sorry, we have to reset your challenge because something happened there. And you'd be like, fuck you. Seriously. Like, it's not even just challenging, it's bullshit freaking luck based, and I hate that in games. Door is open, the door to retard. It's Tauros shit, man. Regain the build earthquake, not bad. Refresh, of course, you gotta have some refresh in your life. And tail whip. That's an odd move to relearn, isn't it? Regain the move body slam. Ribbon! I don't actually have a nickname for Tauros, though. I've got an idea. Yes, like you may have just notice this. Like you didn't put Dragonite in that, but that's because I think we might as well have Dragonite, you know, tag along with us. Purify him that way, or is it a she? It's a she! I've got to think of a nickname for Dragonite, but I haven't really, you know, sat down to think of nicknames since God knows when. Uh. You know, I've just been wondering, you know, throughout this, it's just like, I've been using the same team for the longest time, and it really should, you know, spice it up a bit. It's like, seriously, I at least get some of these Pokemon to evolve and all, you know? Like, Swine of the Palace Swine, maybe have an army of Golbats, or even Crobats. At least have you evolve to Ledian. Get to Agron or wherever its name is. Can't be Magnazone because we don't have the. That's the odd thing. Like in the Pokemon games, so evolve to uh, Magnazone. I never knew how to do it back in the day, but I do now because I did that in Pokemon Sun and Moon, or just Moon. Maybe that still haven't got around to playing Pokemon Sun yet. But, like, the way to actually evolve it is to go to a specific area with a magnetic field. I mean, how bizarre is that? You've got to have a game that actually has an area like that. Level up Magneton, or maybe it's Magneton, no, I think it is Magneton. In that specific area, and then it'll evolve into Magneton. I mean, what the hell? Do -do 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 Oh yeah, a lot of my Pokemon are still in the, uh... Uh... Purification Gym, aren't they? Birdie! Man, I forgot half of these Pokemon, honestly. So we got... Oh, him. You know what, but let's just go for it. I'll switch up the Pokemon eventually, but uh, we don't get to level up or anything in the ore cause it would be pointless to bring any other weaker ones. Besides, they just get their asses kicked anyway. Save that for Mount Battle, maybe, I don't know. Or off screen level grinding for them. I don't know, because there's really not much left in the game, really, is there? Do -do -do. So you're still stuck. I wonder if he. No, he probably won't appear in uh, Agate Village anymore. He probably just because he'll be standing here. Welcome to the Orc Coliseum, Have I served you today? There's at least one Shadow Pokemon in your party. Shadow Pokemon. Ah, oh, they're the ones that are in your 
Yeah, we, we know all about Shadow Pokemon. How do they know that? I mean, the protagonist has that freaking, like, scouter thing. For lack of a better word for it. Where he's like, oh, I can see it's a Shadow Pokemon. How the fuck would an ordinary person know that? Do they have the technology for this shit? I don't think they just hand out that kind of stuff, you know. Who should we add to the team? Spice it up a little. I doubt they'd allow any of these into it. Hmm. What move sets have we got? Ice beam. Flare well, why not? A legendary birds prohibited. That's one thing I noticed in Pokemon Sun and Moon, the battle trees. Like, oh, there are some Pokemon you can't use, like the two main legendaries. But you know, like the freaking island guardians, you can use them though for some reason. We can also use the Ultra Beasts. We I mean, want some of that. It's just like, no, only specific legendaries. But probably, like, now that they probably updated the Pokemon Bank thing that I don't have and I've never used, so I don't really uh, know much about it. But the annoying thing is, you don't, don't have the freaking Pokedex, like, natural Pokedex for, like, a reason to, you know, trade over the Pokemon other than, oh, simply so we'll have more variety to battle with and all that shit. I don't know. What, what was I gonna say? Uh, yeah, with that, I wonder if they like updated it be like, Oh, you can't use Mewtwo or Lugia or anything. We didn't say that originally because we hadn't updated the bank thing yet. So they could potentially trade them over. I don't know. Which set would you like to challenge? The unknown set. Thank you. Let the oil cause in battles begin. Please go in. And with that, it's probably going to be a lot of challenges in this place. It's the same dickhead again. And you know what? That part, that was like when I really went to the old Coliseum. I gotta say, Jinx looks absolutely terrifying when he actually used him battle. It looks terrifying just looking at it there. It's like Mr. Popo in drag. What the hell? One and uh, let's, we go. Guns are blazing. And Teddy, of course. Now let's try to have a team of Persona Four here, because that's what name they're after. Are you happy with these choices? You ready to get your ass kicked? No, I am not. Hopefully, I'll win this time. At least just one bloody round. This cheap bastard. No oh, puppy, sleep with a boring match battle. See, I hate this guy. He's such an arrogant dick. Only I'm allowed to act like that. CPU is not allowed to. Hound Oh, perfect. Parasect, you are fucked. That's good on the other hand. Probably also fucked. And was that Moltres roaring or was it the crowd? Holy shit, that was loud-ish. I'm gonna try to keep a hound in at bay there, but also... Punch stop this. Wait, what? Now they're level 61? Okay, this is bullshit. This is clearly they are leveling up with the highest level book when you got. That is some serious BS. Cause that means you have to have all your Pokemon at a specific level if you want to have a fair chance. That is bullshit game. Fucking bullshit. Ah, shit. This game is rigged, I tell you! Rigged! Worse than the boundary, this is. This is bullshit. I'm just going to have to put Espion in storage so I can level everyone else up instead. 
took that one, you bastards. Oh, his fucking slow bro. God damn it. I have seen that shit head. Even though I only saw it the other one other time. I know what you're going for. I know what you want to do with that hound. Doom of turd. Well, that'd be useless, wouldn't it? Yeah, I can't even beat this one guy because I, it's just like, why do they do that? Like, no, 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 they will level up with you. Why is it freaking Final Fantasy VIII? It's bullshit. Clearly see where the, what they were going for there. What can't you? She somehow managed to endure though. Mm. Okay. Give it a shot. You're not gonna get to it anyway, so my god hand, you know. Bullshit! I call bullshit! I mean, it honestly would be better if they had a system where it's like level 50 or level 100. But no, it's like, whoever is your highest level Pokemon, they'll have all the same levels. Bull crap. Bullshit. Glad I didn't go to freaking, you know, level 90 or some shit with Aspion. Even with the helping hand, the jack shit. Sweet jack ass shit balls. Give him a good thrashing. I mean, we haven't really got anything that I can use. Very low whisper the only thing I can really think of to try. Please hit the slow, bro. Fucking bullshit. <laughs> Now he's just gonna knock out Ursaring. I mean, not like I'm gonna win this battle. I'm gonna lose pretty hard here. Of course, it doesn't even fucking work. Oh, this is like the one in Pokemon Coliseum. Do you remember that one in Pokemon Coliseum? Teddy! Like it's outside the main part of the game, like in the main menu, and it has some really bullshit freaking things where it's like, has set levels and shit, it's crap. It's like that, and I didn't even bother with that either really, did I? I mean, I conquered the Battle Frontier, but I didn't freaking do that shit, because even I have standards. I'm Really? I will return here eventually, Mr. I was about to use a seaward now, just how annoyed I am with this bullshit rule. I mean, I can't even freaking take down Iron Boom at this point now, really, can I? It's impossible. Yeah, Sir Wit, you make me sleepy. I'm gonna fucking get you, you C U N T. I'm gonna freaking level my Pokemon up, and I'm gonna fucking come back and smite your ass. Hey, visit. I don't like your fucking Coliseum. Egan, this place fucking sucks. It's worse than the fucking battle tree. It's rigged to high hell. It's shit. It's crap. Worst thing ever. I don't even need to put Aspen that way in my freaking box. Just don't use it in battle. Everything will be fine. Just get everyone up to level 61 and absolutely lay waste to this motherfucker. In this stupid fucking coliseum of rigged bullshit. We might as well bring dragon knives. 
Uh, actually, no. Let's level up everyone else first. We're going back to the good old Mount Battle. Yay! Fuck this game. That's what I don't like about this game. Or any Pokemon game. Battle facilities like that are fucking horrible. They make it so that you have to do very specific things to have any chance whatsoever. Even worse when they have those ones where you gotta like... Do that EV training, IV training, whatever the fuck it's called and I don't understand how it works. Just to freaking win. That is some serious bullshit. Welcome to Van Battle. It's much more preferable compared to that shitty costume with a nice design but shitty uh, stuff. You have cleared up to Area 6? What, only Area 6? Which one is Area 6? I will start from there. I see you wish to start from Area 6. The library will show you there. Okay, Abra, do your thing. Blah de blah 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 blee 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 blah 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 blah. Three, two, one. Zero. I'm gonna have the game sped up for this because it's gonna go up a lot. I have this thing for the ground type. It gets me hard. Ha 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 ha. Which is good because I'm old. You see, it's kind of hard to get hard. You see, at that phase. I should have gone for Area 7 now that I think about it, but oh well. But now my voice will sound to me old man voice when it's fed up. Pick up on this, you son of a bitch! Um, ah, uh, what's prop? I'll caught it in it, you piece of shit! And I figured that even though it's spread up, I can't even do the fancy thing where I like have like a sort of forklift spear. Oh well. Well, I could definitely still do that. Sometimes. It depends whether well I'm talking over or not. That's usually how I decide things when it comes to adding those in. Because if you notice, they're kind of, uh, uh, what's the word? Uh, yeah, can't think of it. Inconsistent. Like sometimes I'll add them in, sometimes I won't. Now I also maybe think I named uh, Cypher Yosuke, didn't I? That's another one. So I thought I wanted to potentially use Mel. Oh, you showed me up! You didn't get a jack shit for XP. I read to rely on extra team and my expertise in the ways of the crowd type. This is really stuff I should be doing off screen, honestly. Youngster, here we go! I sound like the other old guy, but I'm the Monopoly guy. I've made this joke before. It's shit, isn't it? Blah, 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 blah. Excitement. Jog wave and trust up to your face. Oh, come on! Really? Woohoo! Cheer, John! And that's one! Uh, I don't even know why I'm on screen. This. You know what? I'm off screen, actually. <laughs> Fuck it. I'll on screen for the next area, essentially. Because that's probably the area that I have on screen yet. And besides, this is just training shit on the wall. So what I'm going to actually do is, I'm going to have the game slow down for this section here. I'm going to stop recording and start recording once I get to the next area. So, I'll be right back. Alrighty then, I'm back. Just made me wonder, it's like, I thought you said you were going to go to the next area. But I am. It's like, yeah, but why are you halfway through it? It's because I... Part way through, you know, after screen going through this, I checked one of the previous parts and realized that I actually made it to the end of this area and got my ass kicked by the area leader. So, I thought, you know what, I might as well go for off it, but now I'm just like, you know what, screw it, we got an on screen from here. Some um, Pokemon got levels, Sire is now level 61 as well. I think I might get them to level 62, because, I don't know, level 61 just looks odd to me. But there was another thing, which, yeah, yeah. I was now learned Screech in place of Seismic Toss, 
The seismic toss is good and all. But, like, actually, it would probably be useful, depend on, like, actually, let's see. Yeah, now that I think about it, seismic toss could have been good, because, like, it would, like, if we're gonna get GA to level 62 or something like that, then it'll do, like, 62 hit damage, so that'd be probably good, but I replaced it with Screech. And I also replaced, uh, which, uh, yeah, Shockwave with Dream Eater. Yes, she learned that, and I was like, you know what, screw it, you've got Sing, so why not? But the downside is, you only got Psychic moves now. Anyway, this uh, area is kind of tough. Just like last time I came here. Oh my, aren't you a cute challenger? I'm probably gonna get my ass kicked. Well, not really. Maybe a bit. So I guess technically I will get my ass kicked, probably. It's just like I can't really think what Pokemon to actually use to take on the Orc Alcyon because the Orc Alcyon is a piece of shit. You are a cheap bastard, you are a cheap bastard! Oh fuck, I should have known. No. No! Shit. Shit! He's getting all the XP there. Uh, I suppose Yuko would be best suited for this. Look at those wings. No! Teddy! It just wasn't to be, was it? I can't really imagine Lord Sludge doing too well in the War Coliseum, to be honest. It's been a mainstay of my party for uh, quite a lot of this LP, but I don't think it'd be very, like, useful Pokemon to use in the War Coliseum. Either, maybe, ass shot. What else you got? Ah, shit, why? I really should balance my team a bit more. I mean, I got two sidekicks on my team for crying out loud after all. But I haven't even got an electric type or anything, or a grass type for that matter. So, like, again, it goes back to slow bro. I mean, the best chance I got against it on my main team is Espin hitting it with Shadow Ball. But then you gotta worry about getting hit because Espin's still not really as fast as some of the other Pokemon, like Houndoom. Well, nearly as fast, probably, but not fast enough, it seems, you know? Ah, yes, yeah, part psychic type as well, so okay. oh, well, shockwave, even though it never really does much. Oh, shit, he's got the thunder, but he missed. Uh oh. Well, fuck. Guess we got for level 62 after all. What? Ah, fuck. What? Oh, it's like Rhydon and Rhyhorn, isn't it? So it's like. All electric attacks going towards it, but unlike those, main electric isn't immune to it. Just got a high defense to it because it's an electric type. Sludge and Shadow Ball. I see Shadow Ball. Save. 
shit. That just proves that even with that, slow bro is going to be an oddly tough obstacle to overcome. You gotta be sick, nice bitch. Uh -oh. Sludge! Ooh, nice, you're doing it. Just about. Eat sludge, motherfucker! Isn't this like what? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Too bad that Espion didn't have that, because it'd be useful. Whoa, oh God damn it, why? Oh, you son of a bitch. I'll be a slobber rocker. Never mind. <laughs> you look so cute, but you're seriously tough. It took you like, what, seven minutes or so to defeat me? How about that? I guess I'll cheer for you now. Keep your drive going to zone 100. That I won't go to for quite some time, I imagine, because I want to keep my levels at a consistent level for the bloody shitty orc on zoom. 